So when I first started this this project, this channel, and the the website that I that I have back in August, so <laughs> two months ago, I set out to do a monthly sketchbook tour on the last day of every month. So regardless of how many pages I did, I would do a short recap and maybe talk through some of these some of these ideas or something that was on my mind at the time. So now saying this actually comes in very handy because there are very few pages. <laughs> there are very few pages for this month. And the reason being I've I've I mean I've been at home a lot. <laughs> I've barely left the house. I was traveling here and there in August and so obviously I was not gonna take my big my big sketch pad a, a, a three size with me, and so I took my model skin, and and that was sort of I, I almost exclusively sketched in my in my model skin. Then, if I'm at home, I'm not gonna voluntarily choose to sketch on a on a small notebook. I hate I, I don't like it, so I would much rather grab my my A3 sketch pad and and do it that way. And so, even if I have actually managed to practice a lot this month in September. The amount of drawing that I've done on a on the road, let's say, quote unquote, on the road, is very, very limited. I remember sketching this page actually. I was I was in the town center, and there was this group. There was this Venezuelan group street performing, singing, and and it was a Wednesday afternoon, random Wednesday afternoon, and I wasn't in a hurry, and. I sat down to listen to them and, and I ended up sketching for, for a couple of hours and, and just thinking about life. <laughs> I do have very fond memories of that day. It was cool. Actually, these hooded cats made it into, into this other idea that I've called scarecrow duties. <laughs> I'm working on a video for this one, actually, as we speak. And the same thing happened here, actually. This, this happens again and again. I'll be flipping through the sketchbook from weeks ago and I'll, and I'll see the seeds for ideas that that weren't fully formed yet at the time and, and they were slowly sort of coming into being. They, they were just up there being thought of unconsciously probably. And I, I had just read an article on Dobson telescopes and, and how they work. And so this was something that was on my mind. And, and there is this, there's another piece that I'm not gonna show yet, but there's another piece that I'm doing called Dobson Dystopia or Dobsonian dystopia that I hope to finish at some point in October. <laughs>